Don't want to point out something. We've now reached this loading menu screen. Because apparently, I guess, since we're dark side enough, or we progress. I was gonna say, we haven't really progressed that far in the, to the game that we should be having dark nihilist, but nihilist, 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 you know, dark nihilist. That guy with a mask, he speaks weird noises. So anyway, there are a few things we need to do before we do go to the exchange, or go to the canteen, I should say. Because I remembered a few things, and I realized that, hey, we're outside the canteen already. We're gonna look at you. Our lights there too about outside combat bothers me a bit because we just the way we hold it's just weird. Okay, so what does I gotta do? Oh, we're gonna go check the surf on one matter. Try to go under that road in again. Welcome back. Uh, oh yeah, here we go. Batono, of course. He was one of our former employees. Let me tell you something. There are far too many like him. Do-gooders who believe that because of the things Zerka must do to remain successful and profitable, we must be evil. They do not see the impracticality of their beliefs. They do not understand the realities of the galaxy. If certain funds must be paid, then Zerka will gladly pay. If competitors removed, then Zerka will do its part to forward progress. Batono could not see this. Before leaving our employ, he stole many of our records, then began to stalk our movements on the station. Harassment, but conveniently overlooked, sanctioned, perhaps, by the Telosian authorities. That's no surprise. The lieutenant is always meddling in our business. But that doesn't change the fact that Zerka would like him out of our hair. It is, after all, a Zerka matter involving a former Zerka employee. So you want me to go here? 200 credits and the thanks of Zerka Corporation. Silence his lies and fabricated untruths. His slanderous okay. accusations are a needless trouble atop a great many troubles this planet faces. If credits are what he wants, then Zerka will pay him for an easy settlement of this situation. Otherwise, Zerka will be forced into a lengthy petition process with the Telosian Council. Excellent. Zerka will be glad to be free of his baseless accusations and rumor-mongering. She didn't even say anything about that. Uh, I guess that's all I need for that. We know where they've gone. Can't really deal with them yet, so. The time. Did I go back to the swords and yell at them? I don't know. So I went to the. Stories that I was like, oh, I don't know who you're talking about. Maybe the couple of them. Oh, I just. I feel bad for this. Pereki Mangra! 
Doing your try. I like that. Everyone down! <laughs> so far <laughs> okay Dano. Oh, What the? Hmm. You're not CSD. What are you doing here? Oh, you're the guy, right? What? No, you must be mistaken. You're probably looking for a previous tenant or a neighbor. Well, my agent is reported to Zerka. No, wait. You can't tell Zerka where I am. They'll kill me for sure. Fine, then. Here's 500 credits. Take them and forget you ever met me. And if Gren really did send you, tell him thanks. Does subterfuge or destroy out? You wouldn't dare. What good are credits if you aren't around to spend them? Depends how. Well, I did the challenge to be bad with you. But then the challenge to be bad because of what does, but anyway. Welcome back. Truly, I hadn't heard that from any of the searches in my employment. Hmm, that was very proactive of you. In that case, let me thank you for taking care of that unpleasantness for me. I'm in your debt. And of course, here is your payment. Zerka Corporation thanks you for your assistance.
I hear Asgol's been paying mercenaries to go to Dantooine. Can't figure out why anyone would need mercenaries for a planet. Then I could force choke people. And technically, it slightly buffs my stats after I do that, so I can interrogate them then. Alright, now we'll go back. Alright, just like that camera. What I'm trying to do is suggest the way I'm going to do it. Like, oh, you gotta look up and down. I don't want to look up and down. We'll go back to the cantina. We'll want to report a couple of bounties. Just a couple of bounties. Alright, we start near the cantina. So, we're going to get into a new one. Something I can help. What is it? Oh, I don't have much information about him because he's already dead. One. The real Batu Rem? Uh, the same. Oh, what is it? Docking Bay 3. More suspicious activity from Zerka's private dock. If only we had something oh, more concrete, I could launch a full scale investigation. But Narshada? Sounds like you've made some powerful enemies. Here's the reward for the information. And if you find out anything else about Batu, real or fake, let me know. What is it? What have you discovered? Damn that woman. Do you have any proof? I haven't killed them yet. I wish that were enough. To finger Zerka, we need hard proof. As far as the killers go, we need them dead or alive. Our jurisdiction doesn't stretch out to the restoration zones. If you find anything else out, let me know. What is it? Something. Apparently. Apparently nothing yet. Oh, so that's all you gave me? Not natural threats. Not natural threats. Sound dampening. Sound dampening, yeah. Alright, now we have to go into the canteen. I don't know why I have to do this game. It irritates me though. Hello oh, there. Uh, hmm. Fresh blood at the can. Yeah, that's me. Is that all? What a disappointment. Yes, what you were told is true. I can arrange meetings with Lopax Lusk, but you'd have to give me a good reason. And it's been on behalf of her. Well, that's hardly reason enough. Tell you what. I heard about what you did down at the docks. I could use someone capable like yourself to do some work for me. Just consider it a little test. No, I don't like playing games. No? How disappointing. But don't worry. In addition to setting up a meeting with Slusk for you, I'll also pay you for services rendered. I bet I'll help you into this. I'm a reasonable woman. Help me, and I'll help you. Okay. Good. Rejection is just one of the many things I don't take too kindly. So what's this test? I need to make a transaction with two bounty hunters that have recently arrived on Citadel Station. Very simple. Weapons for credits. I want you to go in my place as my representative. They're being very careful, and I'd rather not be bothered. Here, this case holds the weapons they'd like to purchase. I was not told the place of the meeting, only to go to the medical unit in Residential 082 and await a communication. Oh, hey, use for that medical unit. They'd be very foolish if that was their plan. I'd hope they knew better than to try and cross the exchange. And I'll be waiting. Boop, 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 boop. I'm sure I have some credits, just to make sure I could try to get more credits out of it. Oh well, also, boop.
Yeah, for much they have to do with that, but you know. When music is actually sound effects, it's a concern. <laughs> Do you really think it's a good idea to be working for the exchange? No. Just I work with Arsene Torres for a minute. I don't know anyone who's dealt with the exchange and had it end well. Well, if you say so, just watch your back. This is a great idea. Oh, yeah, that one was an accident. Indeed. 
find the troops are Change your business then. Now you die. Aww. Isn't that cute? I think I'm gonna die. Stabity. <laughs> So I take it the credits, right? Uh, at least I got the bow caps, but I hope I got the credits. Well, that means I have to go back, so. I forgot about going to talk to Haran about this. Whoops. But not in this of Maranga. Yeah, sure. And this cream so chin nor to her. Oh, damn, we're still making credits. I don't know. The, I don't know how much I can make off of her, but. Still yeah. in one piece? I heard something about a violent disturbance in the residential module. Nothing to do with you, I hope. Lot, so. Almost. I had enough faith in you to know that you could handle any on-the-job dangers that popped up. But you were able to complete the transaction, right? I think I'll keep the carrots. Can't has to pay. I see. Well, I suppose you earned it. Very well. Keep them. I've got some more work for you, if you're up for it. A matter of a rather sizable debt owed to the exchange. All right, Getting right to the point. I like that. Opo Chano, one of Circa's droid technicians, owes a sizable gambling debt from his last stay on Nar Shadda. We've been patient with him, but we can only uh, let a debt yeah. go unpaid for so long. Oh, I know how that works. Gambler's down on his luck, almost out of credits and doesn't know what to do, then bam, there's a credit line all ready to go. His luck's gotta change, right? So he makes a few more rounds of Pazak, and he's desperate now, desperate to win, little knowing that the decks stacked against him in those 20s are never coming. Next thing he knows, his luck still hasn't changed. In fact, the only thing that has changed is now he owes his life's worth to some exchange boss, and he's getting intimate with a stimmed-up goon with a fist the size of his face. Hey, that's the business. I can't be responsible for your lack of control. Lack of control? Why... Ah, oh, never mind. You'll find Chano in Unit B2, Residential no. 082. Tell him his time is up, and we want those credits. Good. Well then, let's go deal with that, shall we? It's not even gonna be heading that way anyway. Uh... Sound. <sighs> yep. Look, I didn't want to say anything, but you forced my hand. I've heard about the Force and what it does to people who can't control it, or themselves. And it shows in everything you do, and in your face. That's what you think. Trust me, there's a reason you're changing. 
It's because it's corrupting you. I can't help but feel it. All of us can. Whatever that witch is doing to you, she's dragging you down into whatever hole she crawled out of. Well, you're starting to get creases. Almost thought you were that old witch for a second. All right, but I'm out of credits, so it's Republic Senate rules. That's where we waste a lot of time trading cards and trying to beat each other. But in the end, nobody wins. Everybody loses, and nobody accomplishes anything. It's like stalemate, except the goal is to pass time until the audience gets bored and leaves. A practice match, then. Yay, Pizan. Oh, yeah, you just get try right off the bat like that, wouldn't you? Well, the signs are starting to show. You don't look like you've slept in weeks. Or a year. Alright. Okay, all I can do is talk about Berserk. Something up? Alright. <laughs> I like how that's all we can talk about. Something up? No. no. You have grown strong in the Force. I can feel its mark upon you. Be warned. The highest of mysteries cannot be found by falling to the dark side. It is a quick path, and often a short one. But I sense a disquiet in you, an unrest. Such things will erode your strength. They sense the trappings of power and decision upon you. Their lives are static, trapped, and they see one who carries no such chains. Ah, then you have learnt nothing from such small things, from such critical points the universe and its masses may be moved. That is why you must be careful in all that you do and in every choice you make. Aiding them gives you strength by taking on their challenges, but weakens them. If that is your choice, then use their dependency, feed upon it until you have exhausted them, then leave them. And I would view the ones you travel with much the same way. Do you know why those we meet display such weakness? As I said, their lives are static, untested. It is only through interaction, through decision and choice, through confrontation, physical or mental, that the Force can grow within you. You have seen it. You have felt it within you as you have traveled with me. The growing anger, the rage, and the power it brings. 
Yet the power does not build without such struggle. Through small cruelties, greater ones are born. Yes. Very well. What is it that drives you? Oh, why is there a bomb support? One fight on. I confess its nature eludes me as well, but the bond is strong and its roots run deep. It seems that at times of stress and pain, if they catch us unawares, then the pain is transmitted between us. When battle is upon us, I suspect our minds are prepared enough to shield each other from the pain. I think we shall not have a repeat incident of what happened at Paragas. It seems the force flows easily between us. The best guy does that. Yeah, we a know what it is. Anyway. Very well. The Jedi practice many forms, many styles of lightsaber combat. It is good to know them, but not to rely on them. You may have already felt the Shicho, the simplest of the forms return to you as your skill and perceptions have returned. Others may come with time, with experience. Very well. Very well. Of which did you wish instruction? Uh, apparently I don't have any. Very well. Okay then. Do I have a lightsaber form? I don't see a lightsaber form. Uh, I don't know what a lightsaber form would be on. Yeah, it's like I don't have any lightsaber forms. I forget when I get lightsaber forms. But it's like, oh yeah, you Yes. Perry. The Jed you may have all others make. What should I come with time? Ask. Does it matter? Of course it does. Such titles allow you to break the galaxy into light and dark, categorize it. Perhaps I am neither, and I hold both as what they are, pieces of a whole. Know that I am your teacher, and that is enough. Yeah. Or what? Shall you kill me? Hurt me? You would only be inflicting harm on yourself. Perhaps you will keep me here on this ship, prisoner, unable to leave. Or perhaps you will simply cast me out, exile me. It matters not. That is enough for today. Okay, let's see which one was Popo's. Ah, here we go. Tonos de Maragith, Wanarakorachi Drumta, Sa in Chobin Sasha. Tos. Yep, here we go. Tonos de Maragith, Wanarakorachi Drumta. Tonos de Maragith, Wanarakorachi Drumta. What just happened? One minute we're just talking and then I just lost control.
It's like this impulse just came over me. I couldn't stop myself. Next time, warn me. If you're out to kill someone, don't surprise me like that. Oh, we did for this game, apparently. So anyway... If anything I can create, that's worth my time. Nah, still need awareness. Still need... The hell is that? Huh. Well, I'm trying to repel. Still need... But I basically still need better skills in everything. Just need better things than everything, don't I? Or I don't even know where they those scripting can't even make those scripting scopes, can I really? No. Fourteen. Need oh, again. <laughs> Kawana bota yunta tanga kinamatura. Taya. Tu. Dovre kun mili wos kavadumba munsuru kupla liyawa. Bo bagar da hupa bo sakurata go juju to yoki. Kawana bota. Sounds like he says, dude. Is that really helps Because, you know, I've already dead and be bought or half a time. Oh, wait, now we go back. I'm sound off again because she just wants to hang out in the cantina and irritate me. Oh, wait, I haven't talked to you after you okay? your brother or whatever arrested, have I? Look at camera in Doso Ran with no chabi. Do Ran Tamana Sobu. Donos Emeregith. Wanna rock or a cheat room? Well, thanks. I appreciate a discount. And that is. It's about to end off on that. That's all he has, though, which is literally disappointing. And now we go back in here. <sighs> oh, did she made more money? But not a new super. Don't know where such a market. Jawana Masori in Kechajuta na good bawamba. You've returned. Did Chano cough up those credits? You killed him? And how do you expect us to be able to collect credits from a corpse? True, he likely had a good supply of equipment and droid parts that he was to repair or use for repairs. 
We could sell them off and possibly recoup more than the 2,500 credits owed to us. Before you say anything, yes, I will arrange the meeting with Slusk that you desired. But first, I was wondering if you might listen to a proposition. A business proposition, given your obvious abilities. Let me ask you an honest question. This meeting with Slusk you want, it's because Lorso's fed up with him, right? I feel the same way about Slusk, and I think it's time someone solved the problem. I think that maybe our interests lie in the same direction. Well, sure, fine, I think. About you really do get right to the point, don't you? I can get you into the exchange suites in Residential 082. They're west of the entrance. I know what More than are. a few of the guards are in my pocket, so there shouldn't be too much resistance inside. When Slusk's out of the way, I'll clear up this bounty matter and get your ship back. Deal? You don't want to make it sound too easy. We'll speak again, then. Best of luck, beautiful. But somehow I don't think it's going to be that easy. Made it sound too easy. Oh, so where was it? Boop. Boop. I'm terribly sorry, but there must be some sort of mistake. I don't have a record of your appointment. Are you certain it was for today? Oh yeah, I was gonna say, please tell me I should force this way. You know what? There must be a mistake in the system. Why don't I open that door for you? What was your name? Tiffy. Excuse me, Lopax Lusk's appointment has arrived. Please open the inner door. There you are. Have a good day. Oh, you do. Fun grandma more in. Join your two page and speak basic. Well, good for them. This is entirely too simple. Well, you, with pleasure. Fools. Oh, so that's a nice uh, lab station you have there. So, where is. Oh, 
Naruto has destroyed. This shall not stop us from running. Slusk. I may have had a hand in this, yes. Not as soon as you might think. Oh, hi, George. So, yeah. Hi, George. Zap. Zap. Maybe it was Zap. More where that came from! More where that came from! Maybe Nar Shada isn't such a good idea after all. Did we just see what happened? The Exchange is one of the most powerful groups on the Smuggler's Moon. If this Goto wants you so badly, it'd probably be a good idea not to show up on his doorstep, wouldn't you say? Not to mention, I'm sure Lopak Slusk has friends on Nar Shada that won't be happy to hear he's gone. Please don't kill me! I'm only doing my job! I was just saying, I don't know how those lights are, but... I was nice this time. I was nice this time. Why you guys are pissed at me? 
More where that came from. More where that came from. Specialist. Yeah, I really need to work on my skills better. Power is what I got. Strategy fat. Eh, what do I want? Oh yeah, I never mentioned about the feats, did I? I got about dual strike too. Gave her a nice lightsaber when she doesn't even have a lightsaber. Guess I should probably make her a lightsaber at some point. Also, force shield. Hi, Crowler. Yay. It's for new work on my powers. And I need more feeds, too. Oh, so what the hell is that? <laughs> seconds long. Be reasonable, Lorso. You really aren't in a position to take such a negative view to our demands. We're not asking for much. If you agree to our terms, we'll make sure that Zerka never even hears of this. I will not be badgered by you. Thank Sir, we have some visitors. Ah, there you are. I was wondering when you'd arrive. I'm disappointed, Lorso. In the end, this was the best that you could do? Ah, well. I always was one for aggressive negotiations. Well, aren't you stupid? Boop. Boop. More where that came from! <laughs> I had my reservations about some of these mercenaries, but I had hoped that CSD would be able to keep them in line. It appears that I was wrong. Do I need as many mercenaries anyway? Mercenaries stay here until they are transported to the surface. The restoration zones have proven to be extremely dangerous due to the deadly creatures imported by the Athorians. Of course. I understand the importance of keeping a valuable asset like yourself happy. I believe these credits should be sufficient to repay you for your work. You are also welcome to anything found on the mercenaries' bodies as your own. Oh, they carried no Zerka issue equipment anyway. Now, if you'll excuse me, this unfortunate turn of events has generated quite a bit more work for me, and I should be getting to it. But I'm here to do my quest anyway. Oh, power. Why 
by the way. New Padawan. Yeah. I think the ropes in this actually look a bit better than the ropes in, you know, KOTOR 1. But, except for the fact that some of them were, yeah, like that. But this here's a mod, but still. Something's kind of flitching with robes, and I don't know what it is. Also, I just realized you still wear clothing and not that. I just realized that. And I just realized you're still wearing that too. Wow, I am terrible. The hell did I give you, though? I got a Sith banner armor. I just realized that after all this time. It's like, wait a second. You guys aren't properly equipped. And that's entirely my fault. Still my strength D package, got quite a few of those. I mean, that's not bad, honestly. I could have more strength though. More strength. Regeneration though is tempting. But more strength. Man, you're fine with that. And you're fine with that. Welcome back. So, bad you Good. I'll be sure to send some of my men in to make sure they don't have the opportunity to reorganize. You've done well. Yes, of course. I will provide a shuttle for you to land on the planet's surface, as per our agreement. The shuttle will be arriving shortly in Docking Bay 3, Dock Module 126. I have informed Bay Control that you are on your way. Again, Zerka thanks you for your help and hopes that we may continue our working relationship in the future. Yeah. in a different video or in this video? I think I'll do most of this in this video. Could, but doesn't really have anything to sell. I can, however, I like that I could potentially sell my stuff. That seems stupid. Why would I do that? Why would I sell my stuff? Well, my gauntlets are worth more than my armor. That's silly. So, anyway. 
taking those just cause. I already upgrade that. See? Complaints in the Chinese heavy armor to the third armor. Yeah. Mark my swords. Cause they don't sell for much anyway. Unlike these. These sell for a decent bit. Like K. Them some nice credits you have. I'm sorry, yeah, I don't need that one. I'll keep the money, you know, put them just as a souvenir. But I like how those clovers are worth something, these ones aren't. Huh. What else do we have? Crystals, crystals, crystals. Pinhead Flaster. I'll keep it as a souvenir, but otherwise. No, the mine lasers aren't worth anything. But yeah, these ones are worth something. How does that make any sense? Also, yeah, see, look how expensive these things are. Those are only the modified ones. Wow, the modified ones don't even go up in price. Compared to those. Also, I don't need a regular flash pistol with those. Even the bowcaster, just because I like bowcasters. And that. Don't need those. Or that. Oh, keeping those. My sunglasses were something too. And I don't need that. Don't need that. Doubt, doubt, doubt. That one might be good. It's like gloves, man. Boring gloves, sure, why not? Strange gloves are useful, actually. These ones that are unarmed, no. The shields, my armband. We could sell that. I'll keep it. Keep that jazz in case. Don't need this many Stripe D packages. And all these data pads I could sell. And then, oh, my stuff that I could sell. The droid stuff. He doesn't sell both computer spikes and parts, so technically I could just buy parts at him. And I went back the wrong way. have that to do with. 
But anyway, yeah, that's a little pet with deal with Taylor's surface. I'm sure that won't be tedious, painful. Well, it shouldn't really with Anton and his overpowered blasters. But anyway, hope you all enjoyed. Thank you, and have a nice day.